welcome back to my channel with a new video in this video we're continuing the data structure algorithms boot camp and uh, we are doing some advanced three questions now even though this question is not at advanced on lead code it says it's easy but it has like call close to 7000 thumbs up and um it's uh, one of those questions that uh, we'll be using trees with hash maps so i'm doing a series of uh, videos in which you'll be using tree data structure with some other data structures uh, and the question is uh, very simple. Um, by the way, you can check out all the links in the description below for the code sample and the notes and everything else. And uh, let's see what the question says. So given the root of a binary tree, binary search tree, so we know it's a binary search tree, left hand is smaller, right hand is greater. Um, and you have an integer k return true if there exist two elements in the binary search tree that their sum is equal to k or false otherwise okay it's very simple first of all we know we're going to traverse the entire tree so how are we going to do this so let's say we are at five then we can go to three two four then back six seven okay something like that and it says that k is equal to nine are there any two elements that sum to nine they are six and three so how do we know this we go to five then 3, then 2, then 4, 3, 5. Now we are at 6. So when I'm at 6 over here, this 6 needs to know that there is a 3 existing over in the before. How do we do that? We can store it in hash map. Simple. Whatever element you visit, store it in a hash map and check whether the k minus that element exists in the hash map or not for example 5 and 9 5 and 4 is also 1 so you are at 5 you like is 5 existing in the hash map let me see so once uh, let me create this uh, tree over here Five, three, six. Two four seven. K is equal to nine. Okay. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to check and put it in my hash map first. My hash map initially is empty. So this is my hash map initially empty hash map i'm starting with five i'm going to check if nine minus five which is four is in the hash map or not it's going to be like no it's not okay put five over here keep traversing three is nine minus three six in the hash map no it's not okay move forward two is nine minus two seven in the hash map no it's not okay keep moving forward four is 9 minus 4 5 in the hash map yes 5 is in the hash map or hash set whatever you want to call it yes it is in the hash map so the answer just return true so this will return false this will return true this will be false or true true this will return true this will also return true true and true true answer check do recursion for left, recursion for right. Simple as that. Easy. Space complexity O of n, time complexity O of n. Easy. Let's try to code this. Okay. So let me try to code this. And uh, here. To sum. Dot Java. Okay, the code link you can find in the description below as well. Do some Google question. Where was this asked? Google interview question. Okay, it was asked at Google. Or maybe similar questions like this. 
to some tree you can search to some binary tree question asked where all right so i'm going to create a helper function okay mm. and i'm going to pass a hash map or hash set so okay hash set of type uh, let's say i take integer helper function in the helper function i'm going to pass my node the k and the hash set root k set okay i'm creating private boolean helper free node node int k hash set set so i'm going to start from the root node start from the root node and check right first of all check if node is equal to equal to null meaning you are at the bottom of leaf just return false otherwise check if set dot contains what if this contains k minus that elements number k minus no dot value just return true that you have found the answer otherwise set dot put no dot value is it vl yeah and then call recursion on left and right helper node dot left comma k comma set or helper node dot right comma k comma that's it as simple as that let's try to run this and also this will be set dot add and not put copy this paste submit easy cool very simple stuff so check out the links in the description below and uh, for previous videos notes lectures assignments and if you have any questions let me know in the comment section below any video requests let me know in the comment section below and i'll see you in the next one have a great day bye